All right, welcome back. We are we are making a sandwich. We are playing the feud. Playing the feud. I haven't done that. So either. we were talking about Nintendo Direct yes, or, uh, last mm, episode. We sure were. Um, the other things that were announced. Mm -hmm. A new Mario Party game, Chris. Mario Party, yeah, that's right. I I don't care. I know. Yeah, it's like I don't care. I know. I'm not a fan of Mario Party. Yeah, it's too fucking bullshit. It, it's all right. I mean, it's all right. It's all right. It's just so dumb luck that like. Yeah. Do you want to give the sandwich to Karai on? I mean, not really, but I don't have a choice in the matter. It's one of those things that it, like Mario Kart's one of those things that Mario Kart Mario, uh, Party. Mario Party is one of those things that like it always gets super competitive, but it also makes no sense to get competitive because winning most is of the games are like luck. ninety yeah. percent luck. Yeah, <laughs> so it's like really I don't know something about it just always. Oh, dude, he gave it way. a piece of food, and then it just disappeared. And then it pooped away. <laughs> he, well, he just ate it so fast we didn't see it. He just he like inhales it. You know, he's just oh like, look at that. Like a Seems like someone's got a proper appetite now. Right, <laughs> 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 fucking your hands gone. <laughs> Duh, my hand. <laughs> oh no, he's evolving. He's becoming sentient. <laughs> Rhydon can jump higher now. Wow. I bet that can't be used to break anything in the game. A lot. <laughs> no shit. It seems like that fellow is just slowly regaining his original strength. Still, it doesn't look like it's anywhere close to returning to its battle form. Battle, 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 battle. Battle, 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 form, form, form. It seems healthy enough physically. Maybe it got some kind of metal... Mental Mental block, block that prevents it from returning to its true form. <laughs> A mental block? I've read about it in books before. Mental blocks are what have me for preventing me from giving love. <laughs> a mental scar. Like psychological trauma, you know? I think it's what you call it. Maybe it's a terrifying experience in battle, so now it's scared of battling at all. Wow. Well, that's gonna be real bad for it because it's a Pokemon. That's all they do. <laughs> no, he's he's our car. He is our car, to be fair. He's our bike. He's our bike. He's our motorcycle that uses <laughs> his legs to run. <laughs> well, now, well, don't worry. I'm sure that brute and Mass Bostiff will regain their full strength eventually. Isn't that right, Mass Bostiff? Who's our good boy? So how do you feel? Rough. <gasps> no pressure. Oh, do you see the Pokeball just fucking sitting on the thing? I, I, I did see it. I think that's that's it's actually supposed to be there, unlike when I first played the game and the fucking Pokeball is just sitting in the middle of the fucking stage. Yep. Because it's just like, these assets need to be loaded somewhere. <laughs> I gotta load these assets in here. <laughs> uh, don't, in effort, blah blah, broof. Broof. It's okay, don't worry. Dante, I gotta make sure you're alright as rain. You're a good boy. Derek, I, I His dog need you is to dying. chill out with your fucking weirdo dog thing. <laughs> <laughs> he just wants his good boy back. Your dog is gonna die. Get over it. <laughs> and I'm gonna kill it. And I'm gonna be the one who kills it. Well, we got one more herb to go. I bet it's the best of them all. It, it's gotta be. Alright, Dante. The next step is our little herb to hunt. Should be the last. Don't... Oh, we went through these quick. There's only four, I think. Ah. Uh. Um, well, it can't lose steam until we're done. Let's keep the momentum. Well, here we go. Go, go. Gra? That man is real <sighs> hype. Well, he's getting his good boy healed. Uh, that dog is dead, man. What dog is dead? You can't heal old age. That dog is dying. <laughs> it's... Pokemon, though. You can't heal old age with sandwiches in the same way you can't heal mental disorders with penises. That's but really, can... really inside baseball. <laughs> but I can fix her! <laughs> hey, Dante. It's Ooga Booga. <laughs> this is Sadada. Sadada? I detect that Karaidon has regained some of its original power. That's great. When did we meet? <laughs> well, it can jump. While riding it, if you press B and hold it for longer, you can jump higher. Just like Spyro. You must continue helping Karaidon recover. So what you're telling me is he jumps, he has a higher jump if you hold it, and he can glide. This is just Spyro the Dragon in Pokemon. Yeah. Uh, we do get the ability to climb. 
So it is Spyro the Dragon in Pokemon. Then he also learns to climb and swim. This is just Spyro the Dragon. I can't believe they would steal these concepts from Spyro the Dragon and put them in a Pokemon game. Yeah. I can't believe No they originality it. whatsoever at Fuck this Nintendo. studio, man. God damn. You know, Game Freak is just a terrible, <laughs> cheap corporation. It's, it's ridiculous. You know, they make they make so much money and they can't hire new talent. Oh, wait, no, no nobody wants to work it there because they're just cancerous. <laughs> the, the new talent... No, Derek. The new talent works there for, like... In six hours. months. Yeah, for like six months maybe, and then leave. And then say, yeah, I worked for Game Freak. Game Freak! Man, wild battles are weird. Do you appreciate that our Pokemon is nowhere to be seen because it's yeah. clipping through the fucking light? I, 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 to be fair, I kind of figured that was going to happen. This is really close quarters. <laughs> That's kind of one of those, like, where else were they going to put it, you know? Yeah. There's nowhere really else to put it. <laughs> God. Yeah. I still can't believe this was fucking $60. I still can't believe it's not bugging. You know what's great? When the Switch 2 comes out, they're going to make another Pokemon game. It's probably going to be even worse than this one, and it's probably going to cost $70. And people are still going to buy it. Yeah. Derek's gonna buy it twice, because he's stupid. <laughs> uh, you mean I'm gonna buy a copy, and then my partner's gonna buy the other version. Oh, I'm sorry, your whole family is stupid. <laughs> can't argue with that, though. That's the problem. <laughs> I should pick these up, but, like, you know... I want to get, like, used ones, because, like, I do not want to give Game Freak my money, because that's just encouraging them to be fucking this. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> you're just encouraging them to keep doing this. Until people stop buying gar garbage, people are going to keep making garbage. Because they know you won't give a shit. Yeah. Why do you think Bethesda has gotten away with it for so long? <laughs> not as much anymore. No, people are finally getting over it, and I'm like, oh my god, finally. You know what I mean? It took forever for people to finally go, hey, wait a minute. Maybe these Elder suck. Souls graves are fucking bad. <laughs> well, I think the thing that really was the cherry, that bro or the straw that broke the camel's back there... Fallout 76. Was Fallout 76. You say that, but the, because the TV show just came out, there's more people playing it than ever before. It's actually absurdly popular now. There's a fuck ton of people playing it. I know a lot of people are playing Fallout 4. No, no, no. But 76. 76 literally, like, tripled its fucking player count. Well, I mean, that's not hard. Out. You know, if, if it went from t 10 to 30. <laughs> no, they already... No, they're at, they're, they're at I know, like... I know, it wasn't... Yeah, I know, but they're at, like, fucking... Bethesda fans are stupid, so, like, that so, game was terrible, and there was still, like, 10,000 people playing so it. So, what it is, well, like, is <laughs> that they did a really good, uh, faithful adaptation yeah. to, you know, follow with that TV show. And mm. the TV show is actually really good. That doesn't mean the good the games are good. I mean, the lore in Fallout's not fucking bad. It's pretty whack. Well, it's just that they're buggy messes. They're buggy, glitchy messes. Yeah. And, no, the lore is good in... Of every Fallout except for three. Three's fucking lore is awful. In fact, it's so bad that, like, it, it's funny because when Fallout 3 came out, everyone was like, it's the best Fallout game ever made because it was the first one in 3D. Yes. And then New Vegas came out and everyone was like, oh! This is the best one ever oh. made. Oh! Wow, 3 is fucking awful! Holy, how did I not realize it? <laughs> so, do I go do this gym or do I do this? Uh, I don't know. Uh, what, it's up to you. Let's see where I'm at. Uh, we're gonna go do this first. We're gonna go do that. Yep. You heard it, everyone. Derek's gonna go do this. I'm gonna go do that. Um, yeah, because Fallout 3 is like, it's funny, there's like a, so many video essays on Fallout 3. It's funny because like, when New Vegas first came out, people were like, oh, it's not that good. Blah, blah, blah. It's not as cool as Fallout 3. And then like, as time passed, I watched people be like, it's not as good to, wow, 3 is fucking awful, and New Vegas is like the gold standard every Fallout game should be. <laughs> Don't you love hindsight? And you know what's the funny part about that? What's Bethesda that? didn't even make fucking New Vegas. It was made by the team that made the first two Fallout games. That's why it's so good. <laughs> it's... I forgot that. Detail. And then they got into a huge legal dispute over it, and fucking, it was like a big lawsuit, and now... 
Bethesda owns the rights to it outright, and they will never let that team work on another Fallout game ever again. Yeah, because they made a better game. Yeah. It's because they made a better game and then the licensing. Because I guess the thought process was that they were going to get the rights to make all the Fallout games under Bethesda, but Bethesda decided not to do that. Yeah. And they tried suing, and I don't know who won. I think it was settled, and they didn't disclose who actually won. All I know is that the team that made that game is no longer making those games, and Bethesda will definitely never work with them again. <laughs> yeah, I mean, gotta love fucking Bethesda, bro. Yep, so there's that. Um, they went off to make a couple other games, but I, uh... I don't know think, what they are. I don't think, uh... Well, it's... Well, one of them was Outer World, which I heard was good, but it was kind of like... Because they're not a big studio, right? Oh, and they don't oh, have yes, the money know, yeah. for it. So, like, a lot of people were just like, it feels... Interesting. Kind of unfinished. They're like, it feels like it was kind of rushed. And I'm just like... Yeah, it's probably because they ran out of money. <laughs> it's like... Because they're a small studio trying to make Bethesda-level games. And, like, there's no fucking way in hell they're going to be able to afford it. Yeah, unfortunate. But it was alright. Um, I mean, I, I heard good it's things. It's alright. I mean, it, well, it's, I heard good things about it. But I think it's Xbox exclusive, so like no one played it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's like so. It's like no one fucking played it. Outer Worlds. <laughs> yeah, Outer Worlds. Is that the game I'm thinking of? I don't know. I don't remember if it's the game I'm thinking of. Maybe, maybe not. Dante. It's Dante. Thank you. <laughs> hey there, Director Cavell. Hey there, Carvel. Hello, Director Carvel. As I told you, my name is Carvel. Please don't forget. Sure, Director. Let's pick up our conversation from where we left off. I literally don't yeah, remember. Like, that was um, so long ago. It was like a couple weeks. <laughs> As I mentioned, I joined Operation Starfall to resolve a sticky situation and find out the reason behind Team Star's odd behavior. Okay. Above all, I would like to know why the students from Team Star stopped coming to school. Um, just as Penny, I want to know, just like Penny, I want to know, I want this team disbanded for good. Uh, since joining Operation Starfall with you, I've already had some success in opening a dialogue with Team Star, and I think I'm starting to understand more clearly. Are you? <laughs> but I don't think I've had enough information yet. That's why I want to speak to the students from Team Star's other squads as well. I intend. <laughs> I love the pompadour. <laughs> to take on another base, you know that I can count on you. For, you can count on me for backup. Till then, see you around, Dante. Okay, bye. Bye. Have a wonderful night. <laughs> I'm gonna go to this way. <laughs> well, I guess it's time for me to do this myself. <laughs> I mean, I love that. Like, mm -hmm. oh yeah, there's the gate, but I, I clearly could just walk into the base, right? I mean, you could, Derek, but, like, what kind of villain doesn't use the front door? You mean hero. No, I mean villain. If we go in there and wreck some shit. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> mm. I... Mm. This is fucking I, slow. You know, it's, it's fine. That's, like, what, 15 frames a second? 20 yeah. frames a second, maybe? Something like that. <laughs> It's fine. It's whatever. Do me a favor and go home already. No, I want to see the boss of Neville Squad. Take me to Dawn. Navi Squad. <laughs> it's in Navi from Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time, Derek. How do you not hey. know Navi? <laughs> hey, listen. <laughs> ah, okay. <laughs> Take me to Dawn. Arteus? Arteus? Yeah, that sounds right. Like I said, kid. The boss told me not to let any outsiders pass this gate. That includes you. I don't care. I'm not leaving till you let me talk to Don Atius. <laughs> I'm not leaving this spot. Give me a break, you do little doofus. These people seem to be arguing over something. What do you want to do? Let's kill him. Say hello. Get a little closer. I would wish to collect his eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> huh? Oh, great. Here comes another rando to ruin my day. I don't think grunts work. 
for Team Star Newbies would be this much of a chore. Dude, I was in a group chat with people that just, I know, this was like a long time ago. I was in a group chat with people. Uh, it was like eight or so, eight or ten people in a group chat, and this fucker comes in and literally calls me a rando. And I was just like, who the fuck are you calling a rando? I'm like, you know what, who the fuck are you? I know all the people in this chat, and I go to school with them. Who the fuck are you? <laughs> If anyone's the rando, you're the fucking rando. I don't even know who the fuck you are. <laughs> I love that because it's just like, yes, you might not know who they are, but every why are you in this group if it, you didn't know people in the group? Yeah, like immediately, like get the fuck out of here. <laughs> did you tell him off or did you just be like, oh no, I fucking lo- I fucking ripped into him. I was like, yeah, uh, no, I don't fucking think so. This is our group chat. Like, get the fuck are you? They knew someone else in the group chat, but they knew one of those people. I was, there was like a, fr- it was literally a group chat of mostly my friends from fucking middle school. <laughs> like, who the fuck are you? <laughs> it's like... Anyways. It's uh, hold on, Mr. Grunt. I think this guy might be Dante. Wait, what? Dante? Demon Slayer Dante? <laughs> the guy who picks a fight with Team Star? That's the one. Yeah, prepare to be raided, or yeah, that's me. <laughs> prepare to be raided is hilarious. I knew it. <sighs> Hey, oh, oh boy, boy, this isn't good. Everybody else is, is still asleep since we were up late last night playing video games. You know what? Cool, squad. <laughs> Leave it to me, Mr. Grunt. I'll buy some time for you to wake up the others. Yeah? And what's it for you? Don Atlas will be in danger if no one here can defend the base. I owe that man my life. He's my dear, my dear compereri. And when the crisis calls, one has no choice but to rally to those dear to him, no matter the cost. Fucking pulled out a knife and stabbed the kid. The kid yeah. <laughs> yeah, I have no idea what you're on about, kid. But thanks for the assist. <laughs> no any time, small child. <laughs> Alright, you villain. If you're after Don Atlas, um, prepare to face my wrath. Wait a second. <laughs> Hold Hang on a second. On. <laughs> Punch. <laughs> I like to imagine that it's just like, prepare for a fight, and then you just like, punt this kid 14 feet away. <laughs> Pretty much. Derek, no, it's not weak to electric. Okay, it's dead. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you know what I don't understand? Well, one, why poison types are so bad? But like, why is po- why is ground strong against poison? I'm not sure. Mm-hmm. You're covering up the poison with dirt. See, but like, that's not how poison works. In fact, if I've learned anything from how we tortured the people of Vietnam, I would know that poisoning the ground just makes all their food literally toxic for them to eat for, like, a millennia. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, you're right. You're right. So, like, poison should be super effective against Earth. We're I constantly poisoning Earth. <laughs> Don, I failed you. Dante, are you all right? Blah, 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 ruckus. Kids fucking doing shit. <laughs> Dante, are you alright? Yeah, I was just beating up this eight-year-old. <laughs> no fair, you had backup this whole time? Is this kid one of the academy things? He doesn't look like a Team Star kid. You're right, I'm not he a... He doesn't member. look like he should be old enough to go to this school. Like, what the fuck do you mean? Yeah, this is why I'm confused, because, like, the ranges of people are, like, kids that age, and then, like, like legit grown-ass yeah, adults. Yeah, like, full-ass adults. Yeah, like, what is this school? <laughs> He's my companion. Uh, I have to see him no matter what. Uh, you clearly have your reasons for being here. Uh, Dante, I have the questions. You go ahead and start the base. Um, I am wearing you for champ. My, uh, my, uh, my man. Uh, I didn't mean to bite. <laughs> my man. My man. Hey, my man. <laughs> hey, it's me. Nice job dealing with the guard. Derek, it's rude. <laughs> it's a JoJo reference. <laughs> Within the base lives Team Star's Poison Squad. Their boss, Atlas, he's in charge of designing the outfits for the teams. You can see he has clever hands. That guy also (laughs) is a bit of an eccentric. You can't tell what he's going to do next. Well, beyond us to predict how he'll respond to the declaration of war, uh, just take out as many of the squad's Pokemon as you can until he shows up. 
ring the bell at the gate. Once it's open, kick off the phase of this operation. Time to wipe out Team Star. I, I like that he I like he has clever hands. Oh no, I sure hope he doesn't use those clever, clever hands. hands. <laughs> uh, I'd be sure it would be a shame if he snuck up on me with his clever, clever hands. hands. <laughs> Free bing bing. We have some fool. The team star star fool. Are making their move against our base. The first fool was folks. <laughs> it took me a minute to be like, what the hell are you reading and where the hell are you? <laughs> you mean, get, you know what that means, gang. It's time to take on this kid and avenge our teammates. Hey, little interover, as you can see, you'll have to defeat 30 of us in 10 minutes. And our dear boss will think, will deem you worthy in person. Heh, <laughs> break a leg. These gangs have weird rules. <laughs> Yep. Three, two, one, go. Go, begin. Oh my god, Venonat. What are we in, Gen 1? <laughs> Who the fuck runs a Venonat? <laughs> oh god. You know what? Venonat feels like a Pokemon that they would have made, like, an alt form for, you know what I mean? Yes. But it hasn't? It's weird to me. Haunter! It's a good thing no one has a Gengar or else they'd sweep your stupid Pokemon team. <laughs> True. Oh my god, and a Surviper. God, they're literally using all the poison types they have because there's like five Four. good poison types in this game. <laughs> Can we, like, I think I've brought this up, but, like, can we talk about how bad poison typing is? Oh, it's not great. Game? It's, like, really fucking awful. I, I appreciate that, you know, they gave it a, you know, another type to be strong against in Fairy. Yeah. But it really is still not strong. It's still really bad. Because, like, it's strong against Grass, I think. There's, like, a lot that it should be good against that it isn't. It's strong against Grass, Bug. I don't think it's strong against Bug, actually. Poison? Poison's strong against bug. I don't think I so. I think you just don't think it is because a lot of bug types are poison. Yeah, maybe. I'm pretty sure it's strong against bug. I think it's just strong against fairy and grass. No, no. It was definitely good against two types before fairy was released. And I'm pretty sure it was uh, bug. Because, it, like, insecticide, it's poison to them. Yeah. So, like, I'm pretty sure it's poison. Yeah, I'm, pretty I'm sure not it's sure. Bug. But I'm looking it up because I'm curious. This man is fashionably <laughs> ready, as always. Oh, no. He's got one eye. Pray forgive. Oh, yeah. Pray forgive my sudden entrance. Tis I, Arceus. You're that scoundrel Dante, I take it. You have some nerve being your fangs at Team Star. Come then, a very uh, huh. villainous wrench. A plug into grim poison shall be your well-deserved fate. What's up? Literally only grass and, and fairy. No shit. It's not bug? Uh, no. What the fuck? Yeah, God, it, poison is fucking terrible. awful. And it's weak against ground and psychic. It should have been strong against normal types. Agreed. And bug. But mostly normal types. I don't know why the fuck they didn't make it strong against normal types. Especially because normal is only weak to fighting. Yeah. Like, why? Mm. <laughs> Come now, villainous wretch. A plague on into grim poison shall be your f well desired fate. fate. On God! He's a ninja, and he's poison. Why are all the ninjas poison? I guess that makes sense, right? Because ninja's poison. Yeah, I like that design, but, but I also find it silly. They, it, I mean, some of them should like be dark every, type. Every Pokemon game, though. I mean, I think a ninja that's dark type would work, too. I think sometimes they get, like, a dark type, but it's, like, half dude, dark Dude, he's got, he's got a repeater ball. That means he's caught this Pokemon before. Mmm. A skunk tank. A skunk tank. But we'll have to do this battle in the next episode. We will. We're going to have to pick it up. Oh, wait, hold on. They're going to... Can we pause on this dialogue? No. Okay, we're going to have to do this in the next part. We'll see you guys then. Peace.